seems like Espa's reputation is taking over at all fronts in the K-pop world. After storming all the music charts, at the moment, the rookie group are hitting the headlines with their stunning visuals. Guess what? Winter just beat Blackpink Jenny and Lisa to conquer the brand value rankings for October. This surprising result of the Korea Institute of Corporate Reputation literally thrilled fans, because other EPSA members also took over the top six. Well well well, with this unique beauty, the four rookies seem to completely set a new visual standard for K-pop female idols. Okay, don't keep your eyes off our video now, because the next update will absolutely make you go what the heck. Can you imagine that? The tickets to BTS's concert BTS Permission to Dance on Stage Los Angeles are being sold for up to 80,000 US dollars? Oh my god. How crazy it is. Seems like even when selling my house, I'm not sure whether I can get this precious ticket or not. So just a few days ago, Ticketmaster announced that tickets to BTS's upcoming concert were already sold out, thus no public sale would take place as planned. Due to overwhelming past purchaser and verified fans' pre-sale demand for BTS permission to dance on stage LA, all shows are sold out and tickets are not available for the public on sale. This news literally blew armies away because Ticketmaster is the monopolized company that sells tickets for this BTS's concert. Ever since the news broke, the price of concert tickets has been pushed up to dizzying heights in the black markets. Right now, Fans must spend at least 400 US dollars to get one ticket, though it's previously sold for several dozens of dollars. More shockingly, in better areas, so many tickets are being resold on K-pop forums for as high as 80,000 US dollars. OMG. Honestly, it's just a ticket for a concert, how come it can be outrageously expensive like that? At the moment, fans are flooding onto social platforms to vent their frustrations with Ticketmaster. They claimed that this company must have done something hidden because it's Ticketmaster who has profited most from this lucrative trade. Meanwhile, many fans are also asking Hyde to make a strong move to address this incident. With these outpriced tickets, there's a high chance that lots of armies can't help but give up meeting the seven boys this time. Well, perhaps, the only way to view the BTS's concert is via digital streaming. But who knows, maybe the price will return to normal in the last days ahead of the special event. There's still over a month left until BTS's shows, so keep calm and wait for the good news. Stay tuned with us to get any further updates about the boy group. That's the news for today. Do like, share and subscribe to KBiz Hub if you don't want to miss the juiciest news next time. Bye bye.